Hello, boys and girls, my name is Hotsy and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included, where last time I promised you we will go for looking uh, for a solution to get more steel. But first, we have to solve some other issues, mainly our water supply. And easy way is to convert some polluted water into normal water. And here on this side with our power production, we're actually producing water. So what we can do is have a bit of a platform going there and placing a sieve on here um, having a pump down there and we need power going there and there and pipe going up here and then this is a bit on the warm side so we actually need to cool it and this setup is not working um, so that's why we will open up here uh, fix the setup and then also open up here because I think the best way to cool the water is to actually lay a pipe through this uh, cool water basin and um, cool it that way so we need to break this one and that one and hopefully all right so the system here that does not work because uh, the liquid from here can flow back on this side so what we will do instead is have uh, I want to break this pipe Um, actually, we don't need to pump out the, the steam. Uh, what I wanted to have is... This one goes over there. And then we have another one going up here. Um, and then this one connects to there to this input flowing over uh, and that cannot flow in the other direction. That should solve the problem. And then here on this side we will just have it like this or we can have a complete loop or almost complete loop um, but we probably actually we can do these pipes uh, out of uh, lead 
because they're in here and it does not really matter if they are ugly so and we will have this pipe going up here and I mean the, the pipe coming in there it does not matter if it's insulated however the pipe going out that's another story so Oh, that connects nicely. Uh, then we need to uh, dig a bit more space out here so we can actually build this whole thing. And then here as well. And there we probably need a ladder. And then here, insulated pipe, we bring that up and over. Um, this pipe we are not needing anymore. Bring that up to here. Then up here. And there we can just drop it. So all we need to do is place in that piece and here we will need a bit of a bridge. That should work out nicely. Uh, we disable the auto repair on that one. And then I think it's more or less just a manner of, uh, of letting the, the duplicants do their, uh, their work. How are we looking research wise? We're researching uh, this monument because that's uh, what our goal is in uh, this series. And I think we are not too far off, um, mainly because this time around our goal is not that difficult to reach. The main hurdle we still have to to overcome as we need quite a bit of steel but if we have solved that issue then it's as always or almost always just a matter of time um. maybe we can pick up this dirt and then we will jump forward in time until we have finished um, this setup uh, for the cooling of the water. We have the first water coming in here and if we look uh, at temperatures we are going in with 33 degrees we're coming out with 727, so we're cooling by 6 degrees. That's not much, uh, and that's probably because the polluted water in here is uh, already at 23 degrees. Uh, but uh, we need to cool 
this further down and now that we are actually fixed this setup um, should be possible to do so however uh, we lost quite a bit of uh, uh, water in here when we uh, opened it so we have to uh, fill that back in and with the water being a, a rare resource, uh, this still may take a while. Ooh, but we get two tons here. Let's see where they take that water. Yeah, of course. For our research. But now with water coming in, we should be able in due time to fill up the supply in here that we need we need about um, 200 kilograms on the floor that should be sufficient here on this side is looking good we are using up the backlog of natural gas because this one is dormant and uh, the only gas sources is here from the oil refinery and from the oil well however now the big question where do we get uh, the additional iron from we do have a bit of iron ore here but this asteroid is not really um, that rich in iron ore so what we will do instead is here on this side we will go up as far as we can and um, eventually we will reach the uh, surface and uh, from the uh, asteroids that dump on our or the meteors that dump on our uh, asteroid sometimes we get a bit of iron and other metals and that's what we are collecting and we are also refining aluminium so we eventually want to switch out all this heavy wood wire with uh, uh, the heavy wood conductive wire that can hold more power and does not have that negative an effect. And we eventually also want to bring the, the power cable down here and then uh, connect with uh, a connective wire into our base so currently we are going bang through the middle and that's not good enough in the long run but let's see um how much water yeah we still need a bit more uh, how we are doing research wise yeah need to finish that one and then we can tackle this one and after that I think we shall finish all the other research that we have not yet tackled um, we can replace this one already I think the, the joint plates those are the most difficult ones to replace because you have to break them first and then you have to uh, reconnect them and the thing here is um, our main batteries and main production at the moment is here on the upper wire however as soon as we have this one 
we can break this and uh, add the joint plate there and then I think we will leave that in place because uh, with the with the new wire I don't want to go um, through the base so we will do that in and around and with that delivery I think yeah we are good and we can actually I mean down here it does not really matter what we're using we can close this off and soon as it's closed off we can uh, switch this switch and cool the thing some more I mean in the meantime the water getting out is 31 degree and the water in here uh, is also up to 25 degrees so Of course that was bound to happen and here on this side oh yeah ah there there's even more water um yeah we will have to see how we get let's go up here then over a bit and up further all right then oh yeah that's done and let's place another tile here flick this lever and see if this is actually uh, working yes and now we can basically set this to zero degree that should cool down polluted water to um, or let's say we want it at 14 degrees because that will cool down the water to zero degrees and uh, with that we should be good enough so the water in here does not freeze that that would be that would be bad but the water coming back in here is now at nine degrees and we are going down with the temperature in the tank so that's good that's good um, and uh, we will continue uh, our journey here upwards and i think once we have reached the surface uh, that it's time for another update and i probably also will start replacing some of the wire here with conductive wire according to this message we have made it to the top it's not too much on top of here and as we can see we have gold amalgam here lying here we have what's this we have iron refined iron and we have copper ore there However, looking at uh, the iron ore that we have, we are sitting on 80 tons. So, as usual at this point, the steel production is mainly hampered by the amount of lime. So, uh, I also went up in here to try and dig out as much of the fossil as possible because we can convert that uh, to lime and on the way up here we found some ethanol 
and we also found a cool steam vent however uh, this water is still hotter than the polluted water down here that we can we are currently using and we also managed to uh, finish the research on the monument for the base we need sev seven and a half ton of seal and then some obsidian i think we can get that steel will be the tricky one then for the middle port we need five ton of steel uh, two and a half ton of ceramic we have and we need uh, the same amount of plastic which we do not yet have and then for the last one another five ton of seal uh, 2500 kilograms of diamonds which we don't have and glass which we also don't have yet but until we get to that point uh, some time will pass and I think uh, in the next episode we will have to find a place where we are actually building this monument so stay tuned until next time goodbye